Alright, so I think it's about time we start hunting other maps again because Quattro's been out for, I think, about two weeks and I had that video not too long ago. It was called, like, Diamonds and Rares I've had laying around where we got a couple of rare reindeer. And this Medved room just has a ton of room for improvement, so I want to focus on reindeer for this. And then if we can get, like, musk deer, wild boar, some true rack moose, I don't have any of those in here. Anything like that would just be a huge bonus. Like, I just want to get some things in here so I can get an idea of how I want to sort of set it up. Okay, I've been looking at this for a while. And I didn't even realize it was a 5, but I'm quite confident it's not a diamond. I think that's just like the the reindeer scoring, or, or being at level 5 while they're scoring kind of low. So I'm not going to be too careful with my shot, but I think I'm just going to let him pick his head up and then kind of shoot center of the chest, try to get heart or lungs, because we can actually get a second shot in there if we need to. So if he will do that, that'll work. And I want to check the must deer tracks because anything that I can get, I would say like over 900 in that area, I would keep just to have like have something on the wall and then, you know, we can work towards improving it from there. So it was a two and I wish I'd have left him spotted so I could get his track easily, but I think we'll find it. He must have been the 12 kilo one, so he's not going to be that big. I won't worry about that. And this dude, of course, is a gold 909. I mean, not bad, but... He's got the, the cool split backs that I like. I think, at least for now, I will actually taxonomize him. Maybe throw him in that multi-mount. Because uh, we'll have the leucistic, this guy, and then if we can get a diamond or or something like that. I think that could look pretty good. Because I want some variety in it. I don't want, like, two, you know, very similar looking diamonds in a rare or something to that effect. But, uh, yeah. All these musk deer and bear aren't that interesting. So I think we'll just go to the other lake. That's a pretty wonky looking fella that's also a five what the heck's going on i mean again it's not going to be a diamond you can tell by looking at it it's got like no chance how is that one even a five i guess i didn't think the last one would be either but uh i'm apparently closer than i thought because everything just went alert and level fives have bodyguards so couldn't just throw a shot in there and again i'm not gonna not going to try to be too careful with this, because I know that I'm not messing up a diamond. But I think that'll do just fine, although... That might help it along. I think I must have just got a single lung. But, I mean, we found two fives, so <laughs> I guess that's good. Not exactly what we're looking for in terms of score, though. But I'm planning on being, like, relatively selective with what I shoot in this video, because I'm wanting to go at least into moose drink time and, you know, see if we can get a good-looking true rack moose out of the lodge while we're at this. But, uh, he's actually bigger. Somehow. <laughs> I, I don't see it. But he's unique. I don't know that I've ever shot one that's got, like, these type of tops. Well, I don't know. There's there's a ton, and I didn't show them at the beginning like I meant to, but there are a ton of plaques where you can put the reindeer, so... I mean, those unique antlers that are pretty high-scoring ones, I think those are good ones to actually have in there, so... You know, things don't look all the same with a bunch of diamonds or whatever it ends up being. There's another... Like, I think it's leucistic again. I mean, rare reindeer are fairly common... But I think that's going to be like the fourth one that I've had since the new lodge, so... I don't know. I don't know if I'll actually throw it in there anywhere, but... I mean... We'll take it. It's cool to run into. And yeah, I'm pretty sure that's leucistic as well. You can see like the... The spots on it that... Pretty much give that away. But... I mean, we're not exactly finding... Like, the specific things I want, but a rare and two level fives, can't complain about that. There's another decent four in there. I think it's probably going to be the last reindeer unless we run into some randomly because we're getting pretty close to nine. And that'll be when moose start drinking, so I want to... Oh god, well, that's a 300. Uh, good thing that wasn't one of the fives, I guess. But yeah, I want to uh, focus on looking for moose. And I don't know if we uh, if we'll go for anything else or not. Like the main thing I want to do is just get stuff kind of set up. So I don't care too much about scores. I wanted to find some better musk deer, but that's 
I don't know. They only drink from like 3 a.m. to 7 a.m. It's such a tiny window. It's hard to really look for them while looking for other stuff as well. But, uh, yeah. That would have been 816, I think. Guess it's good we did that to the smallest of the ranger we shot, other than the rare one. I think we're going to try to get that, just on the off chance that it actually scores decent. I don't know why they're moving now. They shouldn't be, because, like I said, their drinks don't end at 7 in the morning. And actually, I was thinking after I said that, the reason it's such a tiny window is, like, to hunt them in daylight, you have from 5 to 7. That's like a half hour real time. But let's not use the wrong gun. One of these will be it. There we go. And, of course, he's moving now. But I think that'll get him. He actually didn't look that big to me, but we'll see what he is. Yeah, he's just even a silver, I think. He would have been a silver either way. But, yeah, I don't think we're going to bother mounting that one, then. Ooh, that looked kind of big. He's just a four. Uh, I'm not sure, but he might be essentially the same rack as the legacy one that we have. I think it is, which would be kind of unfortunate, but at least it would be like a true rack variation of it. So I guess we're going to have to call him out of there because he's just perfectly behind that rock. And probably we'll give him like two or... Th I'm not even looking at the right rock. I'm just going to say we'll give him two or three calls. And that 100% is... The old, like, the legacy small diamond big four rack, which is exactly what I have mounted in the medbed lodge at the moment. But, you know, like I said, it'll be a true rack variant on it. It's still going to be kind of different. I don't love that angle, though. I don't know for sure that I can get into both lungs. That would be better if I can keep them spotted. So I haven't shot a moose with the 300 in a wild double lung, but that looks like it did just fine. But we're actually going to have some real additions to the lodge. I mean, maybe not permanent. You know, I'd like to uh, get diamond for the moose. At least I want one diamond reindeer for the multi-mount. I don't know if I'm going to put the multi-mount together right now. I mean, we have two very different looking level fives and the leucistic from a couple of videos back. So maybe I will. But, uh, yeah, it'll be nice to actually add stuff. Meanwhile, I got lost while I was talking. Where did he go? Okay, so off by a little bit. He was 569, so he'll be, I think, over 900 by a decent amount. 915? And actually, you know what? He is unique. He doesn't have the brow tines on this side, so I'm pretty happy with that. And I noticed that. I thought I saw while I was spotting them, but he didn't have brow tines, and then I saw this one. And just assumed they were both there, so... A little bit of a... A character... Rack? I like that. Again, maybe not permanent, but... It'll have a home in the lodge for now. I mean, like I said at the beginning, I just want to have things set up so I know, like... What to hunt, what to try to improve on, what to... You know, what, what to uh, add to the lodge that's going to make it more complete looking. So I think at least, if nothing else, we're doing that. And there's another thing that might be worth shooting. I can't tell if I can see tusks on him from here. Yeah, actually I can. I think I'm not going to say he's over 900, but I do think that's a gold. So probably I want to alert him and use the right gun. So I think I'm just going to walk at him because I don't want to run and lose my breath because you do have to be reasonably accurate on the must here. The 223 doesn't have like a lot of room for air. So I don't want to be out of breath trying to take the shot. I'm actually surprised how close I'm getting to him. But if we can I wanted the heart shot, but eh. I think we might have gotten lucky. I feel like we got lung and something, or maybe he's just dying that quickly. But, uh, yeah. That's two that I didn't get the the perfect shot on now. But yeah, he's, he's 14 kilos, so a little better than the other one. 875, he would have been mm, 880, I think. 
So do I mount that? And I did just miss the heart. God, that's close. I'll do it for now. I'll I'll go ahead and throw him in there. He's a, a thousand cash to mount. It's not a really a big deal. And at least we'll have something. So now I want to get a lynx or another must deer just so it's not like asymmetrical with just one up on the wall. I don't know where this guy is at at the moment. I'm thinking he might drink up here. But 560 is going to be, I'm pretty sure, a different style of rack than the one we just shot. But still right about 900. So that would actually be nice. And then maybe I'll go hunt must deer a little bit to like get another one for opposite the one we just killed. Alright, that'll be him. And the angle's a little bit odd. Like the wind's bad, so I'm not super confident I can like crouch my way over here maybe I can I kind of thought he noticed me but just getting by this tree I mean we're only like 100 meters away so I'm a little more confident we can get double lung or or lung liver from this angle so I'll let him bend down to drink one more time or he can actually make the angle better and we'll just go for it there so I think we either got double lung or liver, because he's going down quick enough. And then, yeah, we'll actually have a little bit of a, a wall going there with the two moose that we'll have from this. But he ought to be, like, right about 900. 896, not too bad. And yeah, we got double lung. Just, just uh, being that close made a big difference. So we'll send him to the lodge. And we are going to go make it muskier drink time. And I think we're going to try, like, this area and maybe some other spots if we don't get any decent ones. I think that guy there is going to be our best option from this lake. And I don't know if he's actually decent. Maybe I might be able to see a little bit of tusk. I don't think he's that big. So we're just going to go for double lung from here. Hopefully actually get it. Maybe? I think he's dying quick enough. I mean, he's 13 kilos, so assuming I didn't mess him up, he will make gold. And maybe that'll work. Actually, I did mess him up a little, and he still made gold. He's not that bad. 840, he would have been 847 or something. So you know what? I think that's good enough. Just to have, like, a baseline in the lodge. We'll mount that. And again, it's not a big deal. They're, you get, like, 700 cash for killing them, and it only costs 1,000 to mount them, so it's not too big a deal. We'll go get everything set up here. I mean, that looks way better, and I, I'm kind of realizing it the more I look at this. This dude actually has, like, two different antlers, so this side is the old legacy. This is not. This is something completely different, and I didn't even catch on to that till just now, so go figure. But, yeah, um, this is the leucistic female we got. I threw the couple of musk deer up there. I did go ahead and make the multi-mount. I think it does look really cool. I mean, especially with the variety of antlers. I do like it. And the one... No, I took three reindeer down. I didn't put them back up yet, but they'll probably go over here. I don't know if I'm going to keep them. They weren't uh, anything too special, but I don't know. I might do that. I might just hunt for more of them at some point in the future. But for now, we actually made some pretty good progress. I'm quite happy with that. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.